Do you want these smooth, aggressive zooms for your edits? I am Superman. Why are you watching? Hi guys, today I will teach you how to make a smooth zoom transition. Then first like this video and subscribe to my channel. Also you can get my zooms pack for your edits where you will receive every zooms which I use in my edits on my main channel. You can get everything which you need to make an edit on my discord like software, plugins, and scripts for free. So let's start the tutorial. First ready with your clips, in my case, I choose Superman for this tutorial. Enable frame blending and de-blur for smoothness. Now pre-compose your layers and add your Twixter settings. If you want a tutorial on Twixter then comment section is for you. After adding Twixters, make adjustment layers on all of your clips. I am using this script for adding adjustment layers faster. You can get it from this channel. Now you are thinking why I add adjustment layer for zooms? Bro trust me by adding adjustment layers can decreases your render time and also some bugs like this. After adding adjustment layers search for S Blurmo curves and add it to your first adjustment layer. Now make a keyframe of Z-Dist and go to the end of the layer by pressing O on your keyboard. Now set the value to 0.6 because we are making zoom in. Select your keyframes and press F9 to easy ease them. Open graph editor and copy my graph as well. As you can see it's looking better but we can make it more better so first change the wrap X and Y to reflect for more smoothness. Now copy the effect by pressing Ctrl plus C and paste it on your next adjustment layer by pressing Ctrl plus V. Add it to your adjustment layers and adjust the keyframes by pressing Alt on your keyboard. Now pre-compose all of your layers. Now add your best color correction the edit. If you want this exact color correction, you can find it on my Patreon for 4K quality as well. So don't waste your time and start your edits with my presets. Link in the description. Again pre-compose your both layer and add your RSMB settings. If you want RSMB settings to make your edit smoother then watch this video where I explained everything about RSMB. Now you are ready you can render your edit. You can press caps lock to export more faster because by pressing caps lock you can pause your preview of the edit. I hope this tutorial helps you a lot and now we know how to make these zooms. Now you have to choose a tutorial for the next video. First one is picture transition like this. 
Second one is line swipe transition like this. And the last one transition is like this. But first you have to complete 2k likes on this video so I can start making a tutorial for you. In the next video we will make transitions like Yanni Bro. Comment the transition you want to learn. If you like this tutorial then put like on this video and subscribe to my channel. See you soon guys.